Hi everybody, Rob Jarek here, product manager for TMAC Agro. I'm at our innovation farm here in Wisconsin today, uh, looking at our alfalfa treatments. Now the alfalfa field behind me here, this is gonna be cut and harvested tomorrow. We're looking at third crop, and wanted to talk with you a little bit about some of the treatments that we're evaluating here uh, in our innovation farm this season. You know, if you look at TMAC Agro, we've had a long history of producing high quality foliar nutrient products that really help promote plant health, support plant growth and development, uh, and in the case of alfalfa, improve feed quality. You know, and as you look at feed quality, that is one of the most significant parts of our, our alfalfa crop because the more feed quality, the better digestibility we're looking at here, uh, the better, uh, the, the, the more milk we're gonna get out of each ton uh, of the alfalfa that we produce on an acre. So as we look at uh, real quickly, a couple treatments here I wanted to focus on. I'm going to start with just kind of looking at our control plants. You know, if we look at our control plants here, I, I took uh, some cuttings from uh, the field here off of each uh, individual crowns, kind of representative of what we're seeing out here. In our controls, we've got a little bit of uh, a leaf necrosis happening down low, um, but overall, the plant actually is pretty healthy. Um, we see stem count wise, you know, we're seeing somewhere in that neighborhood of about a dozen stems or so uh, on our controls. So when we turn our attention to Fertilator Gold, which has been one of our uh, alfalfa focused products for, for some, some time here, improving feed quality and digestibility, we see we've got really good leaf retention down low. Comparing it to the control, we've got significantly larger leaves, uh, really not seeing any leaf necrosis happening. Um, and, and why this is important is because when we have more leaf area and larger leaves, we typically see a, a higher nutritional value. We see a higher protein level. Uh, and when we turn our attention to stem counts, you know, we've got a, a probably about a 5% or so increase in stem count here, uh, which is going to typically lead to a little bit better digestibility overall. The other treatment I wanted to highlight with, with you here this afternoon was a product we call Team Up. Team Up is a micronutrient package with some zinc, boron, manganese, copper, and molybdenum, really targeted at improving plant health and supporting uh, nitrogen uh, assimilation, nitrogen metabolism within the plant, which is really where our protein comes from. So it's kind of important to, to have the nutritional support there to do that. And the one thing that you notice here, I mean, we've got stem, uh, healthy leaves all the way up and down this, this plant, but the significant stem count increase that we've got versus our others. This is really where this treatment seems to be standing out behind me. Uh, you know, we're seeing a better than a 27% uh, increase in stem counts uh, from what I've evaluated here today. Um, you know, it's not gonna be the tallest in uh, the plant in the world, but I think we're gonna see the tonnage uh, as we harvest this here uh, be very comparable uh, uh, to some of the other treatments and, and significantly higher than what we've got in the controls, just simply because we've got such an increase in stem counts. And, you know, we keep that stem count high, we keep the digestibility high because the stems are a little bit thinner, more digestible for our dairy cattle. So uh, just wanted to share a couple things I'm seeing here on Innovation Farm uh, in Southern Wisconsin. Uh, thanks for listening.